Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to Apocalypse 1.0. It is the morning of day 19. I do have a few skill points to spend this morning. Let's use two of them to get Perception to level 8. And let's put one into the Penetrator. We're here at the base this morning to take a quick look at what we got going on here. I upgraded the first row of hatches to iron. The second row is still wood. I don't think that's a problem. This is where the fighting will start. And when the zombies are going to break through these hatches, we'll make a break for it down this hallway. The hallway is lined with three blade traps on the ceiling. And down below, we have 10 rows of electrical fence wire, all of which are protected. We'll make a break for it up this ladder and then down this one turn on both of these switches which will turn on all of these traps and then we'll use the rifle to snipe zombies as they're getting electrocuted and chopped up and when they make it to this wall we'll bust out the sledge get in some melee work i do have some hatches right here for more protection we got to be careful right here though because we're kind of boxed in i put in another wall right here so what I'll probably do is just make sure I have this hatch opened already so when they do break through that wall, we can quickly jump up here, close this hatch, we could go down this hatch, or we could jump down here. I might have this sealed up by night 21 though. If I do, then we go down the hatch, we get some more work in right here, melee, guns, throwables, and then I'm going to have more traps in this little hallway right here. And uh, that's going to be it for night 21, and I think that will be plenty. So... Let's go. First thing we are doing this morning is heading down south. We're going to go see Bobby and see if we can complete the tier three jobs and open up the next trader, which should be Trader Hugh in the snow biome. What are these chickens doing in my town? You look like you can handle yourself in a scrap. Don't squat on your spurs. You'll do well. I'm an East Coast Yankee, Bobby. I still don't know what that means. Here we are. Bob's Boars and fuck Carl. The home of grace. I figured this would be a good job to do. Because I'm running low on meat. Aw. <laughs> don't look at me like that. You were in a cage. I freed your soul or whatever. Oh, a She-Hulk. Getting greenies already on day 19. Oh, it's because double XP. Duh, I keep forgetting. Which means... Night 21 might actually be crazier than I expect it to be, because that's actually more like Night 42. Yeah, we could definitely get radiated zombies in the horde, maybe even a demolisher. Better make sure I get those additional traps put in. There's a weapons bag up here, but instead of pulling our way up there, we can just destroy this block right here and grab it. Sell that bat. There you go. Easy peasy. You just keep pushing buttons until the fire goes out. <laughs> I don't really know what I just did. I'll take the nitrate powder and the oil shale. I'm good on the lead. We'll just mine more lead soon. Oil shale and testosterone. There it is. Boom. Chem station unlocked. Beautiful. All right. We'll get one of those crafted tonight. Now, if we can just find eight vehicle books today, we can also craft a motorcycle tonight. Here we go. Grace shouldn't wake up when we land. Nope, she's a heavy sleeper. Okay, we could break through the wood planks, but since we have parkour at level 2, we can just jump right up here. And squeeze through. There we go. Now, we can take her out before she breaks through those wood planks, so let's just wake her up. Oh no, she's stuck right there. 
Well, that's lame. Grace is broken. They need to open that cave up more so she can get out. Oh, she dropped a red bag. Damn, three vehicle books. Armor crafting kit, ammo. That was a nice bag. Thank you, Grace. Her bag isn't broken. Oh, we got rotten flesh from her. I guess no more edible meat from Grace. That's a shame. I mean, it makes sense. She's radiated. I always thought it was weird that you got edible meat from Grace. So, I'm okay with that change. I knew I could count on you. Here you go. Well, that's pretty shit. 186 for the repair kits. Guess I'll take those. And I'm just gonna sell them you right back to them. I don't need them. I can craft repair kits pretty easily. Yeah, Bobby doesn't have any vehicle books. He's got ammo and throwables. We'll just hold on to our money for now. Come I'm going to keep soon. doing jobs we for him. This one's close, and it's an infested, so I've we'll get a bunch of jobs. ammo from it. Have a gander. Here we are. I think I already searched this truck. I did, but we can fire this up and do it again. A couple of wiring books and robotics parts. Okay, this is a clear infested. And I'm not too worried about, because it's a tier 2 POI. Should be fine. I just got finished recording the tier 6 infested at Grover High. Uh, I'm pretty much ruined by making that video. I don't, I don't see how anything can be more challenging than that. Here are the zombies, finally. Just a bunch of regular old walking limp dicks. Where's the challenge? It's not in this room. That's bullshit. Now oh, screw this. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, that's not the duck hunt sound effect. What is the duck hunt sound effect? Am I saying duck hunt or duck hunt? No, that's not it. That's the totally rad one. The duck hunt one goes like... Right? Play it. Nailed it. That was like exactly what I did. Here we go. Finally, some feral zombies. Boys won't play a game. Open, shut, open, shut, open, big boy got through. Get this the fuck out of here. Intellect mod gives you plus one in intellect. You can only put that in your helmet. Well, now you can strut sitting down. Let's go, magazine bundle, and hope there's some vehicle books in there. You looking to rev your engines? So this is job number three, and it's hour 15. Oh, bad timing. Oh, bad aim. Got him that time. All right, there's going to be another one of those. Oh, he still got me, even though I knew it was coming. So yeah, job number three, hour 15. Maybe we can squeeze a fourth job in if we rush through it. You know? And this is tier three. But still, 
like I said, you're going to start a new playthrough. Um, definitely just max it out, and then you don't got to worry about it. You don't got to think about it, you know? If you're already in the middle of a playthrough, and you're on tier 5 jobs, then you don't even got to worry about it at this point, because you're never going to do three, more than three tier 5s in a day, you know? Uh, anyway, moving forward, for me, that's just a setting that I will always max out, and then not even think about it. Close that. Oh. Strippers in the attic. That sounds like a softcore porn horror movie. Silencer schematic. Come on, just give me some vehicle books. I think they made it way less common. Maybe even impossible, because I don't remember getting one out of a vehicle. But I think they made it way less common to get a vehicle book out of vehicles now. You used to be able to find them in vehicles pretty frequently. I remember just driving around, searching vehicles uh, to get the last few books I needed. Doesn't seem to work anymore. I don't remember this entire series if I have found one in a car or not. I know I always expect to, and then I'm always disappointed. Which is kind of silly. I mean, maybe they saw people were just going around searching vehicles, getting vehicle books. And they wanted to limit that and push people more towards putting skill points into Grease Monkey. But still, that's... It's like... If people want to go... Quick scope! If people want to fucking just go around searching vehicles to get vehicle books, if that's how they want to spend their time, let them do it. I mean, it makes sense that vehicle books would be in vehicles. For fuck's sake, every vehicle has a vehicle book that tells you, like, all about the vehicle. You know what I mean? Uh, hey, look at that. I should bitch more. Come on out of there, monkey man. Speaking of monkey man, did you guys see monkey man? Pretty good movie. It's like India's version of John Wick. Total revenge porn. But the action scenes were pretty sick. I'd, I'd recommend it if you like just revenge porn action movies. There you are. Come on out. Gonna make it real easy on me then, huh? Alright, come to the window then. Works for me. I mean, I got this big-ass hammer, so it doesn't really matter which way you go. You're getting smashed either way. Cornbread. I like corn when it's in bread form. There we go, baby. 43 of 100. We need 45 for the motorcycle, right? Yes, 45. Two more. That's it. We could find two more. Damn it. Level 2, lever action. I reckon you'll be living in high cotton well, now. I guess we'll go with the crafting skill magazine bundle. If there's two vehicle books in there, we got the motorcycle. I'm gonna do this fetch real quick. I'm gonna rush and see if we can get back before he closes. Damn, no vehicle books. And I forgot to sell him all this crap. Oh, this is an interesting one, too. A mansion in the middle of construction. I'd like to take my time here, but we need to rush. We gotta grab the supplies, but I also want to grab the main stash if we can. We really need... Oh, that's open. 
Really need two vehicle books before we go home. That would be perfect. Then we can craft the chem station and the motorcycle tonight. What the fuck? Out of my way, pipes. Zombies in there? No? Zombie in there? Yep. He dead. Oh. No, you don't. You're not fooling anyone. Alright, supplies are this way. There they are. Alright, I should rush back and see if this is the final tier 3, but I'd hate to leave the main stash behind, so we're just going to push forward. Can't leave these crates behind either. Oh boy. He dead. Okay. Whoops. Got him. Where the hell is the loot? Here's some more crates. Forge ahead. Scrap the frames. Grab the paintbrush, whatever. Is that it? That is it. Okay, nice. Oh, shit. Uh, we'll take the high ground. Nice. Sweet. Yes. Weak. You guys are weak. All right. We're just about done here. Let's go now. Dig into this loot. Try and get back to Bobby's in time. I got a couple lock picks. They gotta work. If they don't, I don't know if we can beat into that safe and get back to Bobby's in time. Where's the other book? Did I not grab it? There we go. All right. Come on. Let's go. Shit. Two more. One more. Shit. Well, I'm not leaving it behind. We could still do this. Look at this progress I'm making. I don't have anything to pump my stamina, do I? Honey. All right. Yeah, fuck it. It's not good enough. I'm taking too many stamina breaks. We're just going to use the pickaxe. 17, 16, 15, 14. We're in. I'm just grabbing everything and running. Uh, just buzz this door open. Oh, vehicles. I got to search them. We only need two more vehicle books. Oh, shit. A cooking book. Why is there a cooking book in a vehicle? Son of a bitch. Cue the action music. No, that's that's not action music. That's mariachi. I need action. Well, <laughs> all right. Uh, I could do that, I guess. Bobby. Bobby.